Hello YouTube, I'm Peter and welcome to my kitchen. So as you can see outside, the sun's shining and we're well into spring and it's almost Easter. So for this Easter bake today, I've made gluten-free biscotti soldiers and a cream egg. I remember when I was smaller, we used to always have for breakfast soldiers and a boiled egg. So this is a really tasty sweet version of it. It's just amazing and Oh, it's awesome. They're really easy to make, and I hope you enjoy the video. To start off this really simple biscotti recipe, you need to first roughly chop the chocolate, nuts, and dried fruit. I used some mini eggs, almonds, and dried apricots, because they were what was left in our cupboard. But you can use any dried fruit, nuts, or chocolate you like. Now place the flour, sugar, baking powder and xanthan gum into a large mixing bowl. All of the measurements for the ingredients in this recipe are linked in the description below. Add in the chopped fruit, nuts and chocolate to the dry mix and then grate in the zest of one lemon or orange and give this a mix to ensure everything is evenly dispersed. Beat together the egg and the milk, and then pour this into the dry mix. Bring together the ingredients, then use your hands to knead the mix together into a fairly sticky dough. You may need to add in a little more milk if the mix is too dry, or a little more flour if it's overly wet and unworkable. Roll out the dough onto a surface liberally dusted with flour into a long thin roll about 15 inches long. Transfer this onto a baking tray lined with non-stick baking paper and press down the top of the biscotti to make it a bit wider. This is to ensure they are not too tall and will be able to be dunked inside a cream egg. Now bake this in a preheated oven at 160 degrees Celsius, 320 degrees Fahrenheit fan for about 25 minutes or until nicely golden all over. Once this has happened, remove the biscotti from the oven and leave it to cool. Once it has cooled, you need to slice it using a sharp serrated knife on an angle. The slices should be a little under half an inch thick. Lay the slices back onto the baking tray and place them in the oven with the temperature reduced to 120 degrees Celsius, 250 degrees Fahrenheit fan for about 15 minutes. Once they have cooled, they should be very crisp and have a great snap. Now the biscotti is made, we can plate the pudding. For this, you will need an egg cup that fits the cream egg. Using a sharp serrated knife, carefully cut off the top third of the cream egg to reveal the gooey, sugary center. Serve up the egg with a couple of slices of biscotti and a few obligatory Easter mini eggs. Then enjoy the great fun of dunking the biscotti into the cream egg and getting really messy. So that's how you make it. It's really simple and quick to do and it's also a really fun pudding to put on the table. The biscotti works really well gluten free and I think they're a really tasty treat on their own. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, share and subscribe and go and check out some of my other videos that I've linked in the description. I hope you guys have a brilliant Easter and I'll see you soon. Thanks once again for watching. Bye.